Hi, Badger here. Well, a lot of speculation recently about Sony's forthcoming launch of the new F camera. And there's been scant information really about what this camera is going to bring to the market. What we have known is that it will support 50 megabits per second, 422, HD, 4K. And we probably could have guessed that. And you could be forgiven really, apart from the 4K, for thinking that actually, on balance, it sounds a little as if what Sony are really doing is revamping the F3. That very clearly is not the case, and here's why. The new F camera is actually two cameras, the PMW F5 and an even more super deluxe model, the PMW F55. Both are identical to look at and both pack an almighty punch. Out of the box, the camera not only looks but feels perfectly weighted and reassuringly robust. It's also totally modular, giving operators total flexibility to create their perfect configuration by bolting on accessories from not only Sony, but a wide range of third-party manufacturers from Arri to Zacuto. There's all the connectivity you could wish for. An array of BNC connectors at the rear for timecode, SDI, genlock and shutter pulse, with a direct HDMI output too. Audio XLR inputs sit on the right of the unit, set low on the camera body and USB, headphone and card slots are positioned on the left flank. Both models feature a Super 35mm 4K CMOS imager with 8.9 million effective pixels arranged in a Bayer pattern, meaning that they can deliver 4K resolution to an external recorder. The F55 goes one step better by allowing internal 4K recording to S by S media using Sony's super efficient new MPEG-4 based XAVC codec. In fact, the F55 can even simultaneously record to S by S media in both XAVC and MPEG-2 codecs. Internal recording is performed using a multitude of codecs, which crucially include the broadcaster-friendly 50 megabit per second XDCAM HD422. There's so much codec choice that you can now choose the one that best suits your project, and if that demands the ultimate quality, then you'll be pleased to hear that the F5 and F55 can record uncompressed RAW direct to the dockable AXS R5 recorder. And talking of the AXS R5, it's the first external recorder to completely seamlessly dock with a camcorder. Sony really have thought this one through. Sensitivity is significantly ahead of the competition for both cameras, with the F5 delivering ISO 2000 and the F55 a slightly lower but still impressive ISO 1250. The F55 sensitivity is lower because it features a global shutter which eliminates the rolling shutter or jello image skew effect that's inherent with almost all CMOS cameras. The F55 also adds the flagship F65's wide colour gamut, making it an ideal B-roll partner to the F65. Full resolution, high frame rate recording is supported, up to 120 frames per second on the F5, with the F55 capable of 180 frames per second internal recording, or an incredible 240 frames per second in HD RAW, or 60 frames per second in 4K RAW, when using the optional AXS R5 recorder. The native lens mount on both cameras is Sony's FZ mount, and the cameras are supplied with a PL mount adapter as standard too. The FZ mount has a very wide port and ultra-short flangeback, as well as electrical interfaces for power and data relay, providing compatibility with the Sony SCL Z18x140 ENG style servo zoom lens, and creating a hugely capable large sensor camera package for documentary and other run and gun style shooting. Of course, almost any 35mm lens can be used in conjunction with an appropriate third party adapter. For those who want a shoulder mount format camera, it's great to see that Sony have produced their own modular unit with 15mm rail mounts and industry standard rosettes for mounting hand grips or other accessories. And if that's not enough, how about a new HD OLED viewfinder? Sony's DVF EL100 high resolution OLED viewfinder is designed specifically for the latest Super 35mm cameras. Its compact 0.7 inch OLED screen delivering a whopping 1280 by 720 pixels in conjunction with outstanding contrast handling and clarity. So, whilst the F5 and F55 are positioned below the flagship F65, they're highly specced, packed with features, and they really are raising the bar for affordable cinema grade HD and 4K acquisition. 
So there you have it, a fairly smash and grab view of the new F camera from Sony. Literally, it arrived in a series of cardboard boxes just 45 minutes ago, and the second we stop rolling, it'll be back in the boxes and delivered back to Sony. Now, we're very much hoping to get some extended time with this little beast very soon, and we'll be bringing you a full road test. So check back in.